Hello everybody, this is Drumming Cuber, and today I'm going to go over my mains and goals for Naperville Winter Bee 2022. So Naperville Winter Bee 2022 is my last competition of the year. The next competition I'll be going to, I don't know exactly what it is yet, but it'll be in 2023. And so today I decided I would finally get this video out. The competition is in three days as of the upload of this video. So without further ado, let's get started. Starting with 3x3, I'm probably going to be using this... Uh, Ben cube. I like to call it the Ben cube because at first glance it may look like a Yo cube given the logo, but at Great Lakes Championships, uh, a good friend of mine, Ben, traded me for this. My I had a GTS3 that I traded away for this, and this is really good. So I'll definitely be using it in this competition. And then for my backup slash warm up cube, I'll be using this normal stock Worm 2021. I mean, goal in 3x3, three three, I guess, for this comp is just to, like, get a PR average, and, I mean, I don't really care about, it. I don't really care if I get PR single, because my current PR single is already pretty satisfactory, so, all I'm really asking for is a PR average, and if not that, just some decent averages. And next we have Skub. I'm gonna be using, as my main, as in this comp, just as I do pretty much every comp, this Gan Skew here. I've used this I've used this every single time I've competed in Skew. And really I don't have that high hopes for Skew. I've my recent official results have been pretty terrible. But that said, uh I am just hoping for like a sub I've been wanting a sub six average for a while, but I don't think that's gonna happen anytime soon at this point, so I'll just ask for a PR average. And I'm already pretty happy with my PR single. And then my backup flash warm-up is this Moyu Aoyan skew, which I believe has a dislodged magnet. Moving on, we have square one. Uh, in this event, I'll be using my Isaacs MGC with a very professionally made logo. I made it myself. But this square one is actually professionally made. It is really good. And I will be using it at this competition. And my back of flash warm-up is an Angstrom MGC square one. This is also Maglev, by the way. And then my main goal for square one... Uh, probably I'd say a sub-13 sub average is one of my goals. And then also maybe a sub-10 single. That might, be, that might be stretching it a little bit, because my current PR single isn't that... I mean, it's, it's sub-11, but like it's a 10.8. So I guess just maybe a PR single would be nice, and then also the sub-13 average backing up that. And last, but certainly not least, we have Clock. In Clock, I'll obviously be using a Chi Clock. I have three of them right here. Uh, I will most likely be using this one, the one with the black tape. It's the one I've been using the most lately, and it's really good. But then if this clock feels too slow, I might use uh, this clock here, it's a little bit faster. And then, with this clock, this, the blue taped clock might be the slowest of the bunch, and so I guess that's kind of why I like the black taped clock the best. In clock, my goals, I have two main goals, big goals. One of them is a sub-5 average, I've been chasing this for a little while, so I'd really like to get that. And then also, Indiana State Records single. I've been chasing that for a long time as well. I mean, not super long. Like, I've been trying to get it back for around four, four and a half months. That may not be super long, but I'd like to get it back at this competition this weekend. So that is just about it for this video. If you enjoyed the video, please consider liking and subscribing. And, uh... Leave a comment down below if you're going to this competition. I'll be excited to see you there. And I don't really have too much more to say, so I guess I'll just see you in my next video.